Hi, I'm Mike from Craft Supplies USA, and today we're going to take an in-depth look at the Axe Carbide Tip Tools from Carter Products. Yeah. Carter Products has been making innovative products for bandsaw since 1929. And over the past several years, they've taken that knowledge and made some great products for woodturners like the hollow roller and the multi-rest. The latest products to come out of their Grand Rapids, Michigan shop are the Axe Carbide Tip Turning Tools. They're available in the three popular profiles we're all familiar with. Square for straight and outside curves. Round for inside curves and general purpose work. And diamond shaped for detail work. But Carter has added a few new features that make the axe unique. First up is the tool shaft. It's machined from a 5 8 diameter stainless steel bar that's seated a full 5 inches deep into the handle. This adds a lot of strength and gives the tool a nice balance. On the bottom, a half inch wide flat has been machined from tip to handle that keeps the tool firmly planted on the tool rest. This directs the cutting forces straight down into the tool rest. On both the square and the round profile tools, Carter has machined a slight round over. This allows you to smoothly rotate the tool on edge at about 45 degrees to take light shearing cuts, a key feature of the axe tools. The result is a very clean cut with almost no tear out. The diamond tool is only intended to be used flat on the rest, so it doesn't have the radiused edges. Another handy feature are the color coded ferrules. Blue for square, red for round, and gold for diamond. At a glance, you can quickly and easily identify which tool you need. The one thing that stands out the most from other turning tools is the handle. It's made from American hard maple with a traditional bulb shape at the front that tapers to the rear. And the end of the handle is angled and has flats milled into the sides. After turning with it for quite a while, we found the flats on the sides to be quite comfortable and that they provided a nice point of reference. When rotating the tool on its side for shearing cuts, we could feel the angle was right almost without looking. At the business end, there are high quality carbide cutters that stay sharp for a long time. When the cutter finally does dull, simply loosen the screw and rotate to a fresh cutting edge. Once all the edges have been used up, simply install a new cutter. Also, the cutters are fully interchangeable between the axe and Easywood tools. As an added value, the axe square tool comes with both a radius square and straight square cutter. For those of you unfamiliar with carbide insert tools, using them couldn't be easier. Let me show you how. With the lathe stopped, set the tool rest height so the cutter tip is positioned at the center line of your workpiece. Next, position the tool rest as close as possible to the workpiece. Lastly, hold the tool parallel to the floor and start making shavings. That's all there is to it. As you turn material away, stop and readjust the tool rest so the tool doesn't overhang the rest too far and never more than four inches when hollowing. This directs all the downward forces into the tool rest. Just three simple rules. Cutter at center height, tool rest up close, and handle parallel to the floor. You can turn pens, spindles, bowls, and much more with a simple set of tools and you don't even need a grinder. We're impressed with the axe tools. It's clear that Carter's done their homework here and created tools with distinctly new features all at an incredible price. The fit and finish is top notch and they're made right here in the USA. If you liked the video, subscribe to our channel and give it a thumbs up. Also, be sure to check out our entire selection of wood turning supplies at woodturnerscatalog.com.